let's see, I, I put up this persona that, uh, you know, I'm, I'm this guy who, you know, I, who, you know, makes inappropriate jokes and, you know, you know like, like sex and stuff. But it, it's really, it's, it's not sex that I want, you know, it, it's love, it's companionship, human interaction, the attention of someone that I hold dearly. I want these things because, you know, I, I'm, I'm deprived of them, you know, I, I rarely get them. Sir, this is a, this is a Denny's. People often ask me, how do you do it? How do you have sex with literally hundreds of extremely hot dragons every day? And the answer is simple. All you have to do is be just like me. Go to sleep at 6 a.m. every night. Wake up at noon. Have lots of hobbies and interests, but never partake in any of them. Slip into a deep depression once a week where you lose all hope. Be a furry. Lose the respect of your friends and family because you're a furry. Cry a lot. Just lose all just hope in general. Just 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 be a be a sad piece of shit. Misty, stop being a little bitch and start the video. Oh, you're right, Absy. We should we should we should probably get things going. <laughs> Sorry about that. Ignore my cry for help there. I'll just do what my dad tells me to do and man up. I uh I guess. The last time I read stories, it was New Year's. You know, it was, it was an event. This time. I'm, uh, I'm just really bored. But, you know what? Enough chitter-chatter. Let's get down to the stories. And here is our first story. Fuck! Wh what the fuck? Are you jacking off? Falco! I, uh, uh, cuz... Mm, cuz, you know, Fox, you don't just have to be jacking off. Oh, <laughs> I get it now. How about you, uh, Come over here and help me out then. <laughs> See, the moral of that story is, you know, don't get blowjobs from birds. You know, the, you know, the beaks hurt, it's sharp. Oh yeah, and one more thing. Falco's not a fucking bottom, he's a top. You fucking incels drawing foxes the top, you fucking idiots. Misty, a bunch of buff dragons wearing thongs just arrived asking for your presence. You're serious? I'm I'm in the middle of a. Hey hey Absu, can you can you like real real like quickly tell a story while I'm gone? Absolutely. There was once a man named Joe. Joe Mana. <laughs> Just kidding. There was once a man named Joe, who was 33 years old. Joe's house was in the northeast section of Morio, where all the villas are, and was not married. Joe worked as an employee for the commute department stores, and he got home every day by 8 p.m. at the latest. He didn't smoke, but he occasionally drank. He was in bed by 11 p.m., and made sure to get 8 hours of sleep, no matter what. After having a glass of warm milk and doing about 20 minutes of stretches before going to bed, he usually had no problems sleeping until morning. Just like a baby, he woke up without any fatigue or stress in the morning. He was told there were no issues at his last checkup. I'm trying to explain that Joe was a person who wishes to live a very quiet life. He took care not to trouble himself with any enemies, like winning and losing, that would cause him to lose sleep at night. That is how he dealt with society, and he knew that is what brought him happiness. Although, if he were to fight he wouldn't lose to anyone. <sighs> Ooh, okay, I am uh, back. Thanks, Absu. Uh, what, what story did you tell them? The Joe one. Ah, uh, the Joe Mama one. That, one. that one's always pretty funny. Yeah. The Joe Mama one. Okay, uh, sorry about that. See, it's it's not easy being this hot, you know, constantly attracting extremely muscular, you know, dragons. Now, it's time for a sequel of the previous story. Seriously, dude, you you fucked my mom. Like I thought I thought I made it very clear two years ago. 
that you're not allowed to fuck my mom. Well, it's official. My parents are divorced, and my dad has gone off to pursue a career in writing erotic novels. Damn, dude, I'm, I'm sorry. Does that mean I can know you're not fucking my mom? Okay, okay, just, you know, just asking. Just asking. Okay, but like, have you seen your mom, dude? She's a MILF. I'm, I'm mostly angry because you never even told me that you were in a relationship with my mom. Instead, y'all decided to keep a secret from me. Like, when were you going to tell me? Well, you know, pro probably, you know, b before the wedding. I'm sorry, the wedding? Oh yeah, like, uh, you know, your mom and I are uh, getting married, you know? I'm, I'm gonna be your stepdad. What the- You know, the moral, the moral of that story is, uh, you know, don't, hmm, don't have a hot mom, I think. I, hmm, I, I don't even know, and I'm the one who wrote it. <sighs> well, that brings us to our final story. There was once an adventurer who only wanted one thing in his life, and one day he went in search of that one thing. Days to weeks, weeks to months, months to years. By the time the adventurer found a cave that fateful day, he was no longer the youth that he used to be. He took his final breaths as he entered the cave, and with his final dying moments, he finally saw what he's wanted his entire life. Snake titties. Uh, the, mm, the, mor the moral of that, mm, the moral of that story is, uh, snakes have really good titties. I think? I don't know anymore. <laughs> oh god, it looks like my time in this dimension is over for now. I have to go back to my world to hibernate for a few months. Don't worry, I'll be back when this is finished. Oh shit, I'm getting all oh, echo oh shit. Well, I wish you all a do. Oh shit, what the fuck? Ah! <laughs> I wanna die. Thank you all for watching. My name is Apsu and I'm Misty's manager and video editor. Misty left so now I have to do the outro. I sincerely hope you all enjoyed this video, because it was hell to edit. Do you know what it's like trying to cut 37 minutes of dragon sex out of a recording? Do you know what dragons sound like when they climax? That shit made me want to rip out my fucking audio processors. Regardless, it was a joy making this video, you should definitely check out the first story video that Misty made. You should also subscribe to Misty, and check out the videos on his channel. I guess you could subscribe to Reset as well, I guess. <laughs>